Well, hello there, everybody. This is UCR, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to do Gen 1 and Gen 2 battles, and how to do uh, Gen 3 battles as well. Well, a lot of people have been asking for years, and I've always been trying to, like, I don't know, send them to that one video made by Diego years ago, but I don't know. I, well, I thought and I figured that it would be easier if I just did this myself. This is the first time in my life that I'm actually doing a tutorial. So this is the emulator, okay? I'm gonna leave the link in the description. And uh, over here, you're gonna have to go to Netplay. And on Play, you're gonna put... You're basically gonna select your ROM, like Pokemon Red or Pokemon Gold or Pokemon Japanese Green or... Pokemon Crystal or Pokemon Beta from 97, whatever game you want to play for the Game Boy, TCG, anything. And uh, your rival has to basically select a game that is compatible with the game that you are basically playing. Um, you can have the same ROMs, it doesn't matter, but on your opponent's side, he has to put his game over here on player, and on rival, he needs to put the exact same ROM that you have on player. I mean, it makes sense, right? Over here, server. Server is for the IP. You're gonna select your IP over here. You can either use your own IP if you have port forwarded your router, or you can use the IP from Hamachi. Um, so that's up to you. And on the client part, you have to... Well, it's for the person that is not hosting, of course. He's gonna basically just choose client. And on server IP, you're gonna put the IP of the person that is hosting. On timeout, always put here 6535. Then, the person that is hosting needs to connect, needs to press connect. The other person needs to wait at least, I don't know, 2 or 3 seconds. And then he'll basically click connect to and boom. That's basically how you do Gen 1 and Gen 2 battles. Now, let's uh, move on to Gen 3. Uh, da, 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 Gen 3, Gen 3, Gen 3, let's see here. For Gen 3 you need Visual Boy Advance. For Visual Boy Advance, uh, it doesn't matter if you open the game, uh, if you open the game beforehand, before doing these steps, I'm just gonna start the game. There I am. I, I don't know, this is... The last team I believe that I used. I don't even. I don't even know. I really don't even. I don't even remember. Anyways, so you just go on options you, over here. You go to link. You have to check wireless adapter, and on settings. Uh, for me, this has always worked. Link timeout always eleven thousand. Uh, you select network, you go on safer port number five seven three eight. Both players need to have these. All right, then the person who is going to basically host has to click this and then press start. As for the person that is going to join, uh, he has to put the IP of the person that is hosting, either if he has port forwarded or if he's using Hamachi. So yeah, both IPs go here and he clicks connect against it's like two seconds or three seconds after the other person has started hosting even though i believe that in gen 3 it like you can wait a bit longer it doesn't matter but yeah that's basically how you do uh gen 3 and uh yeah so this is basically how you do it uh as for gen 4 and gen 5 you can use an emulator called melon ds uh Melon DS. This one right here. Uh, this one's just too easy to set up. Like, again, I'm gonna leave the download in the description. I have it on full screen because I was trying to record. Because recording with this emulator is just glorious, okay? The quality is fantastic. Uh, basically, all the options are set. You just need to put the BIOS on the BIOS part. Like, I'm gonna show you. Uh, I forgot actually where to put it on. I think Emo settings. Yes, mode. Yeah, over here. The BIOS are gonna be 
uh, on the description as well. You're just gonna put them there. Uh, ARM9, ARM7, and this firmware. These two need to be put in their place. And uh, yeah, you're just to test if the internet works or not. You just go here, mystery gift, receive gift um, from Nintendo Wi-Fi, and f basically, if you receive something, that means that means you're good to go. You can bell online. And, oh well, we got we got a Celebi, but our thing was full or something I don't even know but this is how you do it gen 1 gen 2 gen 3 gen 4 and gen 5 so yeah if uh, if one day I'm not around anymore I don't want this stuff this stuff to to stop basically and I want you guys to continue playing older gens so yeah because it would be a shame if it stopped completely You've seen all the players that have been battling in the past. Almost 90% of them are gone. So, yeah. Keep on playing, have fun, and we'll see you guys next time.